up for your next photographic expedition? Ready to snap some masterpieces? But before that, how about giving your smartphone a spring cleaning? After all, you wouldn't want to compromise a spectacular moment just because you had no storage space. A bit of smartness, a zeal to capture photos and this video are all that you need. So let's dive straight into it. First things first, get rid of duplicates. Over a period of time, we end up accumulating several duplicates in the wake of getting perfect clicks. These duplicates eat up a lot of storage and trust us, it's not easy to lock horns with them. That's when a powerful utility like Duplicate Photos Fixer Pro can prove to be a life savior. It can easily help you remove all exact copies and similar looking photos to recover precious storage space. To get rid of duplicates using Duplicate Photos Fixer Pro, select a location on your device from where you want to delete duplicates. It could be your camera images, a complete thorough scan of your smartphone or even a particular folder. Let's do a full scan for now. The duplicate photos will now be grouped and you can easily remove duplicates by tapping on the bin icon at the bottom right hand side of the display. Review large items Separating the wheat from the chaff becomes all the more simple when you have the big guns blazing right in front of you. Sorting images and more importantly, removing unnecessary photos can become easy if you are able to identify the large files. Believe it or not, this method can surprisingly help you save several GBs of space. Remember the Google One we discussed in the above method? Here is how you can identify large photos using Google One. Install the Google One app, sign up with your personal account. Tap on free up account storage, scroll down and you will be able to review large photos stored under your Gmail, Google Drive or Google Photos. Tap on any of these and review items. Select the ones you want to delete. Tap on the X icon that you can see at the top right corner of the display. Bam! We bet your phone will be thanking you for making it feel so light. Back photos up on your PC, external hard disk or any other storage medium. Another great and rather important step that you can take after every photographic expedition is to back up your photos on a storage medium. It could be a local drive on your PC, an external hard disk or a flash drive, the choice is entirely yours. With a backup in place, you will at least have something to fall back on should something happen to your photos. Anything could happen in the wake of freeing up storage space, you might delete the right images, God forbid. Your phone might crash or get stolen, your device might get hit by malware, anything can happen. In such an emergency, you can count on the backup you have taken and restore images without any further ado. Create multiple accounts and store your photos. Last but not the least, to sort and even organize your photos, you can create multiple cloud accounts and that is spanning your photos across the likes of Dropbox, OneDrive, Google Drive, so on and so forth instead of a single Google One account. But here's a small catch, you'll be creating 5-7 different accounts to gather storage space and you will have to remember their credentials as well. So that's all. Hope you found this video helpful. If yes, don't forget to give a big thumbs up. Also, subscribe to our channel for more such videos.